For many of us pet owners, we'll know that losing a pet is like losing a member of the family. Well, today, Avon Fire and Rescue in Western Supermare are the first fire service in the UK to be given pet oxygen masks, helping to save animals that have been stuck in burning buildings. We set up to supply um, pet uh, specially designed oxygen masks uh, to the UK fire service because they don't currently have them. Normal oxygen masks that they carry are for humans, um, which will basically go um, over the mouth and the nose. But of course, um, you know, dogs, cats and things like that have snouts, uh, whereas these masks allows the snout to go right in, so they are a lot more effective. Um, other countries have seen great success in reviving pets uh, using these masks. 46% of um, households have pets. Um, and as I say, they've, they've seen great success with these masks um, in other countries. Um, and we just feel, you know, we've got a pet of our own that, you know, they're needed by the uh, UK Fire Service. While firefighters attempt to get pets safely out of burning structures, they are not able to revive them unless they use proper equipment, like these pet oxygen masks. On many occasions, the Fire and Rescue Service have used human masks on animals, but these specifically designed pet masks are available in three sizes and are now being carried on every single fire engine in the town. We're very proud to be the first, uh, obviously the first in the UK, and it's obviously a great opportunity for us to trial the masks and you know, see how effective they can be in operational incidents. Well, we're all about saving lives at Avon Fire and Rescue, and obviously our priority is always the humans, but we always recommend humans get out before we arrive at a fire, so quite often the pets will be left inside and we will obviously rescue them. In the past, we've actually had to improvise with human masks with pets, but now we can actually have masks that are designed for the purpose, they're going to fit a lot better and be a lot more effective. Well, actually, last year, Avon Fire and Rescue did actually rescue nine dogs and one cat from house fires, so it does happen quite regularly. Costing between £80 to £90 a kit, the organisation Smokey Paws aims to raise enough funds to provide every single truck in the UK with the best equipment to help animals who suffer from smoke inhalation. They've got a, um, a unique um, end to them which allows the, um, the mask to fit any of the oxygen tanks that the fire service use. So this can go straight onto an oxygen tank that they already carry for um, uh, human masks. Um, and then it allows them to control the flow of air. The mask itself has got open valves in it, which allows the pet to breathe back out and then take fresh oxygen back in again. The Station 8 was nominated at Western Supermare for us to start. Um, they went through the um, process of being checked to make sure that they were OK for the fire service to use. Um, and now our mission, uh, with everybody's help, is to get these throughout the UK. I'm Rachel in Western Supermare for Made in Bristol TV.